I'm bad at navigating. I certainly am bad at navigating. Let's go down this ladder. What do you say we uh, sing a pirate song to pass the time? Yo ho ho and a bottle of loqua. Edelweiss. <laughs> That's a pirate song, right? I can advise. <laughs> I can advise. <laughs> <laughs> At least the music is groovy. That guy agrees. Yep. Well, if you look at him, he's the one playing the music. Where are the drums coming from, Kendall? From her. <laughs> <laughs> See, she's stomping them, like it's hitting the invisible drums. It's magic. Kendall. Steven. This game is grounded in reality. You're right. There's no magic involved. You're right. Hey, buddy. <laughs> oh, <laughs> goodness. You have a nice ship! <laughs> Have you flown around here a lot? Do you know this area well? Have you seen a ship with all women sailors? Have you seen a ship with all women sailors around here? Sometimes I see them flying nearby. They are very different from the women here. Even with my eyes, I cannot always see where they go. I am very curious about them. Is it because you've never actually been near a woman? A place with just women? Oh, hmm. That's vice. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> a place with, a place with just women? Hmm. Sorry, I can't help you there. Too bad. I won't leave here until I find out. Let's go find that place with all women. But first, there's another person that we can recruit. that lady? No, it's not that lady, it's a different lady. We do have a family! <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. Got drunk there? <laughs> oh, <I> Phil <feel> Collins! <laughs> <laughs> Ago, Marina wrote a letter and put it in a bottle tied to a red balloon I saw released into the air. <gasps> Steven. Yeah? Does that sound familiar? No. Think all across the room. All the way back to the first time we got to Sailor's Island. The very beginning of the game. We went up into the lighthouse. And we saw a message in a bottle. Message in a bottle. Tied to a red balloon. Wow. I do remember now. Oh, I think it was very important letter to Marita. She's having herself a grand old time. Have a grand old time. Have a high flying time. <laughs> and forever in peace may you wave. That is a very powerful ship that you have. I hope one day I will board a ship. I look for comrades to help me get revenge on the Lua. I wrote a letter to Quentin. Just And sent it into the sky. I asked Quentin. to please send me strong warriors to aid my cause. Could this be that letter that... <laughs> ah, could this be that letter by any chance? I pity it off in the ocean. Oh my gosh, that loop, that loop that they were just on for her animation was terrible. It was like, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> This one? No. It was the one before this one. That is the letter. 
That is the letter that I wrote to Quetia. Yeah. I sent it <laughs> looking for help. Quetia. Quetia surely <laughs> sent you to me. You must be the warriors that I am waiting for. Please take me with you. I want to fight against Valua. I, I may not be strong, but I can dance. My <laughs> dancing will lift everyone's spirits. That's what everybody needs in battle. <laughs> yeah, she's a jester. Quetia. Surely she jests. Ah, you jest, sir. I buttle. <laughs> I'm a butler, sir. I buttle. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do? I buttle, sir. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good movie. It is a good movie. That was a weird voice I gave the tavern, tavern keeper. Yeah, it is. Luckily, we'll never talk to him again. Never ever? Never ever. Neville Evel. Neville Evel. Neville Evel. Is that really fitting? It's from Tarzan. Was it? Yeah. It's been so long since I've seen Tarzan. No, and all the monkeys are in the camp and they're like banging There's stuff monkeys. together. There's monkeys. There's monkeys in Tarzan. <laughs> <laughs> wait. Wait. I thought it took place in the big city. That's Oliver and Company. What? Oliver and Company takes place in New York. Is that a thing? Oliver and Company? He's the one with the cat and the dog voiced by Billy Joel. What? <laughs> I know Aristocats. No, not that one. That was in Paris. Hey look, Smoonstone Mountain. Isn't that nice? Hey, look, a random encounter. Isn't that nice? You know the... Why should I worry? Why should I care? I don't think yeah. I've seen this movie. That's okay. It's not one of Disney's best. <laughs> well, <laughs> that face certainly didn't <laughs> seem to disagree. Like, it's not bad. It's not a bad movie. By any means. It is... A pretty good kids movie. And you know, that's saying something, because a lot of kids movies suck. Yeah. So, yeah. Just like kids. Sucking on their popsicles. They really suck. On their sippy cups. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, she almost killed those e-loopers. They're just kind of chilling out now. <laughs> oh, he wasn't having that. Yeah, that was kind of unexpected coming from an looper. Oh, man. We're gassy today. We are. Oh, man. The weed too dank. <laughs> Hiya! Hiya! You say so. That's okay. <laughs> All right, let's find this village of women. Yes, please. Found it. That's less exciting than I expected. You found the Ixonus village. A tribe of women that lives on a small island in Ixitaka. They are they are skilled and fearsome warriors. They raid nearby villages twice a year to kidnap men. The numbers of men in nearby tribes have almost been reduced to nothing. Jeepers. Well, you know what is exciting? They have they have a superhero there. Her name is her name is Amaze Lady. She's she's in the Justice League with with Looper Man. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> and it was just 
hanging out in the corner. <laughs> oh. This is not- Is this, this not- is um, this your ship? Is this not 7173 Southeast? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, this is a ship. Oh damn, I always get those two confused. I must have taken a left that left turn back there, and I should have taken a right. Yeah. <laughs> Did I tell you about, like, there was this super suspicious dude outside, like, uh, a few months back. Like, really? he was, yeah, like, right next door, he was like, hey, is this, uh, you know, and he's like, no. Oh, do you know if anyone lives here? Mm -hmm. Um, yes. Okay, bye. Should I be calling the cops right now? <laughs> <laughs> Well, let's go get Tika Tika, and then skedaddle. Tika Tika. Did I ever tell you... No. ...about the time I almost hit a guy with my car who was walking in the middle of the street? You did, I think. Oh, yeah. That was terrifying. Because I'm just turning around the corner, and he's walking... Not only... At uh, night. Yeah. In the dark, around a corner, but facing traffic. So, like... He's going to have a head-on collision with whatever car is coming around that corner. So I had to swerve into the center lane. And I just, like, stopped and looked at him as he went by. And he just looked at me like... <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, what do I do right now? Do I call the police and say there's a guy who's endangering his life and others? <laughs> it was just one of those moments. One of those days. Might as well jump! Jump! Look at that audio <laughs> spike. <laughs> oh, God. I don't even know what I did there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Satan, what did I tell you about doing that? <laughs> I want to see the audio spike really high? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna Google a picture of it. You have a nice ship! Women only? Maybe you. Maybe you're talking about the village of the Ixinus. Yes! Yes! That must be it! So there really is a village of only women. I've been searching for it for many years! Thank you! You are the best sailor I know! Take me with you on your ship! I want to travel with you! Really? You'll join the crew of my ship? That's right! I'll join your crew! This voice is really exhausting, Steven! <laughs> I've been looking for someone who could make use of my incredible eyes! It's the crow's nest for you. Yeah, we actually do have a, have a perfect spot for him up top. Yeah. yeah. With my eyes, I can see the enemy from far away! Other things, too, as clear as day! This will be useful to you! Ah, oh, thank god. <clears throat> we definitely have a very diverse ship now. Yep. Full of white people and not white people. Yep. I would be proud. He's really good. He he increases our tor our torpedoes hit percent cuz like torpedoes tend to miss quite a bit. Yeah, I've heard Birdman was a good movie. Hmm. <laughs> That's useless. She'll increase your ship's value. Good thing we got her. There's gotta be reason for that, right? I don't know. I, I will have to look that up, actually. Kendall's an expert on this game, guys. Yeah, I've... Hmm. Using the crew command, he will raise your time. Yeah, I think I already read his. You did. Ah. 
Well, anyways, we now have both jesters. Huzzah! We're keeping the dog. <laughs> <laughs> This song is for Dabu. Gotcha. <laughs> it thinks gotcha. for bringing everyone home. That is a welcoming song. We're now leaving Horteca forever until the next time we come back. To get Hans? Yep. When does he stop working? After we complete Yafutoma. Yo! Fat tumor. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. If you say so. <laughs> Later, Vader. <laughs>